No, you cannot make these things up, bro. Um, NFL. NFL news coming at you guys, man. <sighs> well, it's Adam Shifton. I, look, I couldn't make this stuff up if I if even tried. So, the source. All right, NFL sent the memo to all the clubs, all the teams, to let them know that the NFL PA informed the league that a person by the name of Ken Francis, who is a not who is not an NFL um, PA certified agent may be contacting teams and attempting to persuade team personnel to enter into negotiations with Lamar Jackson. Okay? Yeah. You heard me what I said. Lamar Jackson. All right. The memo, the memo said that teams are prohibited from negotiating offer sheets or potential trades with individuals not certified by the NFLPA or any team that does um, it can be fined $54,000, which is the fine for the amount of 2023, all right? Um, 55K is a legal <laughs> trade for Lamar. Um, and like I said, man, this this is pretty, um, it, it makes sense. It makes sense why the Ravens has gotten the job done with Lamar, and it's really just simple. Lamar wants to represent himself and not abide by the rules the NFL has set. And I think this is something when you look at this, um, I, I think the NFL really has, like it, everybody has standards, everybody has rules, everybody has a, a way to go about things to, you know, get business done. Everybody has their uh, way. And Lamar just doesn't want to play ball. And this guy, um, Kim Francis, uh, allegedly he's saying that he has nothing to do with this. He's not doing this. So, look, man, I, I don't, I don't know. I, I will say this: Lamar, just get a damn agent. Like, why is it so difficult for you to just get an agent? Get an agent. Play by the rules. You will get your money. You will still be paid. You would still be playing well over a hundred million dollars. I don't see what the issue. I buy by the rules that every other player is abiding by. You're not special, okay? You're not special. Just abide by the rules. And the fact that the NFL and the Players Association had to go through these, through this length, it's, it's just crazy. And like I said, the, the thing is with this, is that Lamar, is representing himself okay like i said he's representing himself but if you're representing yourself well represent yourself don't have people who aren't certified calling other teams to try to negotiate a deal for lamar jackson it's just stupid like i said it's just stupid it's ignorant and and and, and at this point any person and the only person that is at fault in this in this instance is Lamar. Okay, the NFL has a set of guidelines, a set of rules that you have to have someone who is certified. Your mother isn't certified. Allegedly, this guy Ken Francis, and from the article, Francis said he's not doing it. But like I said, I don't know at this point. All I know is Lamar just get an agent abide by the rules so this is the reason why things have been held up this is one of the reasons why nfl teams have stated that you know the alleged uh collusion that players have stated but this is the reason they do not want guys who aren't certified you have to be in a certified by the nfl in order to become an agent so go through the qualifications, do the right thing, and get paid. But this is just getting out of hand. It's just ignorant. All right, just abide by the damn rules. Lamar, get a damn agent, hire an agent, and get paid. So let me know what you got to think about this, man. Like I said, this is just nuts. I don't understand it. And like I said, 
the only person at fault right here is really just Lamar, right? These, uh, obviously, this is the second time that I've um, heard about this. And, 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 and the first time it was about, you know, no teams want to talk to people who aren't certified. And, and, and like I said, I don't blame them. Why would I want to talk to a guy or someone or a person who isn't qualified to sit down and negotiate said contracts? Why would I want to sit down? Because they don't know how we do things. And this is just the way of business. So this is the way they conduct business. Hire an agent. And like I said, negotiate a deal with the agent. If you just want him to do a certain amount of things, these agents are supposed to be working to work for you okay this is just the way it is you're going to pay somebody if, if you're worried about you know paying an agent too much money guess what you can hire guys for a specific job and i promise you that certain nfl agents won't have an issue with it why because they're getting paid at the end of the day they work for you okay i'm positive that the nfl agent wouldn't want to represent a guy like Lamar. But Lamar wants to do things his way. And like I said, I understand it, but at the end of the day, not qualified. Abide by the rules. So I'm I'm look, I'm sick of it. I'm I'm just gonna be real. I'm sick of Lamar. I'm sick of this whole situation. And it's just one of the dumbest things. And it's just it's just stupid. And this is one of the reasons why we keep saying over and over again why teams are running away from Lamar. And we got these players coming out saying there's collusion, but obviously these guys want to abide. You know, they want Lamar to abide by rules. It's like whether he go through the process of being becoming an NFL certified agent, well, do that. You go through that process. But obviously he's not doing that. And I think that's the issue that the NFL has them. Just ride up by, by the rules. They're already putting in, you know, bylaws and, 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 and rules in place, sending this memo out to players. And, you know, like I said, quite honestly, I, I get it. I truly get it with the NFL. Um, also a little tad bit of news for the Atlanta Falcons, man. Um, Jermaine Effetti, he re-signed with the Atlanta Falcons, so he will be the backup right tackle as well as play a little bit of uh, uh, right guard. So he they brought him back to be the backup behind or compete for that backup position. Um, he may be able to play a little bit of uh, left guard, so you'll see there. But let me know what you guys think about this. This has been your boy, Mad Mike, with another NFL news update. I'm out of here, man. Peace.